So now let me hand it over back to Thomas to show the Scurobot in action in an exciting demo. Yeah, thanks a lot, Saurabh. But uh, I still need you. Um, I need you to type in the questions that we now are going to show sure. uh, in the demo. Uh, so let's dive in. Uh, let's assume I'm an account executive and I need to prepare my next meeting related to Microsoft. So can we ask Scurobot to show some news about Microsoft? So let me ask, tell me something about Microsoft. Hmm. Lots of information about Microsoft and I guess its products. But actually, I'm more interested into their Teams product. So let's ask a follow-up question. Are there any other news around Teams? Cool. Scurobot realized that this question was about Teams in the context of Microsoft. I can see that Microsoft launches a new version with additional improvements. But how can we trust this information in light of the problems of, for example, LLM hallucinations? So please press on the show evidence button. As you can see here, the answer produced by Scurobot comes with context information from your data. I can also click on the evidence. Uh, and by clicking this button, we will see the most relevant snippets extracted from the data using Squirrel's information retrieval. Moreover, the most relevant one was highlighted before in, in yellow color. And uh, this allows us to transparently follow where the information is coming from, thanks to the evidence-based methodology powered by Squirrel's information retrieval. But uh, the skeptic in some of you might make you wonder how what you saw before is different from asking with Bing or you.com. We will probably get similar answers there, right? Note that what you've seen and interacted with on these sites is publicly available information. But you are all here because you want to know how this works with your own private data. In order to showcase this, we have taken the data from our live confluence system, which is our internal wiki, and ingested it into the Spiro bot. So how about we head over to our internal chat now? And let me show you a small example from our internal wiki. Let's assume again that as a new engineer at Spiro, I would like to go on vacation. So let's ask Spiro bot, what is the vacation policy? OK, I can see that it retrieved the right content, but I'm now much too lazy to read through all of it. So let's see if Squirrelbot can narrow it down for me. I will ask a follow-up question based on the already retrieved content. How much in advance do we have to request for vacation? Hmm. And for vacations of one week or more, it is beneficial to ask at least a month ahead for a chance to get approval. Nice, but now the question is, who should I contact for getting vacations approved for engineers? Got it. I found the information that I was looking for. I need to get my vacations approved by Sora. Now again, I would like to find out where this information is coming from. By clicking on the button, I can see the highlighted fragment that shows me the source. And by clicking on the snippet, I can also see the document in Skiro's enterprise search. And finally, I can also navigate to the original document in our internal wiki by clicking on the title. Isn't it amazing to see all of this cool tech working on your own data? Since all of this is already available as part of the Squirrel platform, you can easily go and integrate it into the CRM or other end user systems of your choice. For a change of pace, let's jump over to the Salesforce integration. Now again, let me give you some context. I'm here in our live internal Salesforce environment and interested into the Salesforce account itself. 
So let me navigate into that account. Now I can see a call note that Stephen recently locked into the system. Let's open this up. Okay, we see that Stephen noted down the attendees, the discussion points, and the action items of the meeting. So let me navigate into that account where we already have a Spiro sales sites integration working and operational, but unfortunately not enough time to jump into that today. So let's jump straight to the chat where we will find our familiar Squirrel bot in action. Let me just ask a simple question. What was discussed with Livia in the last meeting? Okay, now the answer comes back with the same dialogue driven and evidence based process, which means that the answer is based on context evidence candidate documents from our Salesforce data. As with the previous examples, we can ask follow-up questions in relation to the meeting notes. For example, I would now like to find out if there were any action items mentioned. Uh, sorry, please type, were there any action items mentioned? Okay, again, it comes back with the right answer. So in the last meeting with Livia, the action items were to provide a detailed breakdown of expenses by the end of the week and send over information on additional services that the company offers. But now let me also show you the evidence candidates behind it. Uh, so if you click on the show evidence button, we again see the right snippet highlighted at the top from Stephen's call notes talking about the action item. And of course, like always, I can click on it to navigate to the full document. Now, what you saw is all Squirrel power, Squirrel bot power integrated into the workbench of your choice in an enterprise ready fashion. Let me now hand it back over to Dorian for the survey results and the final wrap up and guidance on how your enterprise can be at the forefront of this very exciting technology using Squirrel. Thank you, Thomas. Uh, thank you, Sarah. I'm still taken aback. Right. Everybody talks about ChatGPT being the answer to all questions. And then if you look at it a bit more closely, A, it's old stuff, only to 21. B, it's not at all on your own data. And you just answer me the question that I always box me as uh, the CEO of this company. Um, what's the next best action with the customer? What do we need to do to, as an example, engage more closely um, with that set prospect? And you just show that all to me, integrated in my workbench of choice. It's fantastic.